Hey guys, so don't mind us. We look like we just woke up. Go to university, watch my vlog. But we are in Florida. And we going since since stuff is getting canceled, we're going to LA next no, we're week. Not. We're not. That's why you said you're dumb. I didn't say that. I just but didn't you were say quiet. anything. But you're gonna think about it. I know I'm you're gonna about think about it. it. Anyways. Anyways, um, so first stop was gonna be Chick Fil A out of the, um, out of the airport because I'm freaking hungry and I've been craving Chick Fil A. So even in Jersey, Chick Fil A is the way. So even in Florida, Chick Fil A is the way. But we're about to. But after this, it's gonna be all food that we can't get in. Yeah. Ugly Jersey. But. Um, our first stop is going to be in Miami for a couple of days. I've gone like passed by like certain stuff, but like I've never actually stayed in Miami. So this is technically going to be both of our first times in Miami, like the Miami area. So we're staying around Miami Beach. Hopefully like it's definitely, hopefully it's not like crazy. Um, they're not crazy over there with regards to like, you know, social distancing and stuff like that. Um, cause I'm like super anxious about that, but regardless, we're going to have a good time. I just think you can have a good time and be very safe at the same time. You know what I mean? It's like a, so, so I'll hit you guys back up in a bit. We have a three hour drive ahead of us to go to Miami and I'll let you guys know under there. Okay, I have now switched onto my vlog camera. But, I haven't. So, we're eating our public sandwich. And now, we're watching Home Alone to get us in the Christmas spirit. I love how, I literally love how we're watching a New York movie in Miami. <laughs> it's actually kind of, no, because they're going to New, Miami or Florida. Oh, yeah, 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 that's right. Aren't they? Yeah, in the first one. But yeah, so we're getting eaten there. So if you guys are in Cal not California, if you guys are in Florida, you guys should go to a Publix and order chicken tenders sub with buffalo. Why? Nona gave it to us. We should share it with them. But yeah. Order that. It's divine. Good morning, guys. So it's the next day. Eating my cinnamon toast crunch. It's like yeah, nine in the morning. We're going to check out Steve Racine. We're only on business for one day. And then uh, we're going to do some sightseeing, do some photo shoots. Who's vlogging? I'm going to go shopping. Everybody. Go thank her for um, editing this vlog. You're annoying. I'm just gonna vlog on my phone because it's easier than carrying the whole thing around, but we're now going to go shopping for his stuff at round two. No budget. Oh my gosh. But yeah, this place is so nice. I'm like loving the aesthetic of everything. Okay, so we're now at a Cuban restaurant. It's a local Cuban restaurant. It's called Sandwich. And we got a Cuban sandwich to try because obviously um, a lot of Cubans live in Miami and it's a So I like their plantain fries a lot. Yeah. What's the sauce like? It's good. What is it's it? like a garlic aioli sauce. Oh, nice. I don't know if you like that. Nah, not really. Okay, guys, so... Yeah, this already looks better than Cuban Peaks. Stop. Don't even disrespect this place. This is for authentic Cuban food. My parents know how much I love Cuban sandwiches. Let us try this out. 
Better than keeping peace. Cuban sandwiches will forever be. That's like one of those things, like, they can't eat any type of ramen in New Jersey because, like, the ramen in Japan tasted so different. Now, imagine, like, when we go to Cuba, like, I, New Jersey is never gonna satisfy me for a while. That's not ice cream, gelato to be exact. Well, is it good? Sweet. Really? Those. Good though. It is pretty good. I'm happy we got a small one. Yeah, I wouldn't been able to finish anything bigger than this pot. Ready for our, our day two adventure. So right now we're going across the bridge because right now we our Airbnb is in South Beach, so we have to cross the bridge to get to like the my city of Miami. Um, like where the, the Miami Heat play and all of the design districts and stuff. But now we're going to the design district again. We were there yesterday, but we're going there again because I saw on TikTok this like really cool museum um, garage, and it's like all pink. And so miles. it's definitely Instagram worthy. And we're also gonna go. Uh, to this taqueria that TikTok also had recommended and then uh, to another one of his sneaker, not sneaker, streetwear stores um, around the area. So we have a lot to do today. Okay, so we're gonna, I don't think you guys can hear me because it's so loud and an airplane just passed by, but we're here to take some pictures. As you guys can see by the floor, it's so colorful. So I'm gonna try and get an Instagram picture. And we're gonna take Mike's picture right now. So let's give you guys some behind the scenes. Look. What? Turn it off, Mike. Okay, so we're taking our picture, my pictures now, and this is like a really nice area. It's all pink and stuff, so let's take some, let, oh my gosh, it's so dark. So let's take some more shots. Please. Oh, babe, they're done. They're done. Let's see if this one works out. But, like I really like this whole black outfit I think with the pink and the black it just shows my two moods but now I'm freaking hungry so it's about 11 we ate some um, breakfast earlier but I'm so hungry so we're gonna go get some food he's vlogging and ruining my vlog so if Mike ever sees this thanks a lot okay guys so I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's a slide and I'm, I want to know, I want to do it. So, what's the other one? What is that one? <coughs> oh, I'm good for that. Okay, so we're going to see. Yo, it's actually pretty steep. Santa Taqueria for more tacos. But it's such 
a cute place. He jamming out. It's a little too hard right now. Yeah, this is another place, okay? So, this is a spot that I saw on TikTok. So, I want to see if it's any better than the one that I saw yesterday via Yelp. So, let's see. Oh. Okay, so I just ordered a mango mojito and I always forget that I'm going to get carded no matter what. So, I think I was like mad suspicious of it, so I don't know if she's believing, but I ordered the carnitas. I ordered the carnitas. So, let's see. Actually, I don't like this part. Here <laughs> So, let's see what it looks like. Is it good? Is it better than the one yesterday, or you don't know? It's not, right? That was my thoughts exact. So now I know, should we try the churros here or at the other spot? So she's out here eating her mojito, what you think? I'm not eating my mojito, but... It's good. Okay, good. No, I'm driving. Just joking. I can't tell you, like, Miami has like really aesthetically pleasing colored houses. And like, everywhere you look is like a picture opportunity, which is really nice. So tomorrow's gonna be our last day here. No. I'm pretty sure it's mad windy, so I don't think you guys can hear me, but we're at the beach now. Jersey water anymore, does it? Word, it's so pretty. So we're gonna go into the water. The water looks so cold. We finally got some more food. I feel like this whole thing is literally just a food vlog. Because I only bring it out when I only get food. Well, I haven't had a fire in like a year. But we got, it's like, it's called Front Porch. It's this all day breakfast joint. But I got a lunch dinner, and, but he dead ass got breakfast. Uh, have to. I gotta see what this is about. Because all we've been eating for breakfast legitimately has been um, Cinnamon Toast Crunch as per Sir Michael's request, so. I'm excited. I haven't had a fry though in a minute. That's what I'm saying, bro. So now we got some ice cream to top it off. She Hopefully. said French porch was all hype. No, I did not say that. I just simply meant hey, this is it was okay. Finally. This is good. Mm -hmm. Like it, baby? chip. Oh, my God. <laughs> what am I witnessing here? My God. You're witnessing the deflection of people not wearing a mask as they pass by people eating. So, we're in American Airlines and we're going to go to the Miami Heat store. Are you excited? No. I've never been here, ever. I just want to go near the Miami Heat store. So, I'm kind of excited. Oh, is that Mike? 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 Mike! <laughs> Okay, so I don't think you guys can hear me because the music is so loud, but we're here now at a new place. It's called Bitchin' This, where they call you guys bitches. <laughs> I think it's the funniest thing ever, but yeah, I don't think you guys can hear me, so. Okay, so obviously change of plans because I changed my whole outfit, but change back into the shirt that I had earlier and did my makeup for no reason but at the end of the day 
I really wanted that taco spot. Babe, would you say I'm high maintenance or low maintenance? Mm -hmm. Cause we gonna get a good ass meal for less money. But I really wasn't in the mood for Italian for some reason. But them tacos, what does my sister say? What is the word that she says when something's good? No, 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 oh, she, my sister, as, as my sister would say, the taco slapped. It slapped, I think. But, yes, so, now we are going to go back to the taco spot, Bodega, because that place was so good. The tacos, the carnita asada, no, the carne asada was so good. What did you get? I think I got the, whatever the steak was. I think it was like something, was it chimichurri? Like that. But yeah, it was so good because his had potato, uh, potato fritters. fritters or something like that on there. It was it was a nice added delight onto that. So now we're gonna go and I'll see you guys there. We got some. Oh my god, we got some haritos. That kind of. So, they, don't, they have this flavor. in like a supermarket, but they don't even have it in the supermarket here in, this, in like in Jersey, I mean. Here or in Jersey? In Jersey. Yeah, these are good. They got fruit punch flavor. I saw that there was a pineapple and then um, orange. Well, mandarin, but orange, yeah. This is really good. It is. I had it first when I had those freaking mojitos. <laughs> but yeah. So we're gonna wait for our tacos. I tried some oh, new did. things. I don't know if I fucked up. I got my carnita asada. Oh no, not my carnita asada. Same thing. Same thing. He always comes at me for getting the same thing, but at the end of the day, like my thing's always gonna be better than his. You got diversify. I did. I never get carnita asada. I usually get carnitas. Oh, yeah. So, so I don't know if this deserves its own special spot again, but I'm gonna give it again to y'all. And so good. So, I probably shouldn't have got the chair. I probably should have just stuck to the to the carnitas and the um the steak. But it's worth a try, you know. You never know. You never know. So, since this is our last day in Miami, how how would you recap this whole trip? I think it's been good. It's a nice place to look around. Vacation, definitely. But I see now why I like, I see that my love for LA isn't just like a whole, oh, cause it's not New Jersey. You know what I mean? So, I don't remember telling the vlog this, but we were originally supposed to go to LA to do some business work. And, but some, some stay at home order, like got revamped or whatever. So we ended up just coming here to Florida to visit and I said we've never both been really to my I've I've passed by it like I've literally spent like a couple hours here with my family but I've never like explored it so this is gonna be our first time together and individually to go to Miami so I was like yo let's go to Florida let's go to Disney but also let's go to Miami so this is as spontaneous as I can get I love business tacos. trips still on but yeah, we're going to go to the West Coast in like a couple months. Oh no, it's December now, right? Yeah, next month. Next month. Oh bad. Like we already have like a setup with the, with our model, so. They should cheers to it. Let's cheers to building an OD empire. I know, Yo, I know you want another one, but... Go get another one in the churros. Where the churros are amazing. 
according to um oh my god according to yelp, yelp um they said that the churros in a lot of the bodega spots like mom and pop joints is like really really good and we haven't tasted any churros yet so i can't really give like a uh what is that called like a proper rating if i would say so we're gonna try they say it's bomb but we'll see dry ass chicken bro. okay guys so i am now home i'm in quarantine <laughs> um this is currently my second day in quarantine and yeah so i'm just here editing the vlog um and i just wanted to come on here to say i know i didn't get that much footage as we all all had hoped i would have gotten but i really just wanted to enjoy the scene with michael and to just enjoy like our time together because that was um one of the first vacations that we had together where it was our first time going there um so i just really wanted to be present in the time especially with how 2020 turned out and a lot of our plans fell through so the fact that this plan was able to push through well, technically, it wasn't even a plan. Like, obviously, you guys know we were supposed to go to California, but because of the COVID restrictions and the new orders, it just wasn't the right time to go. So this was actually our first spontaneous trip. We literally planned it, like, two days bef before it. So, um, yeah, it basically turned into, like, a food vlog and... I'm not mad about it at all. I'm still happy that I got some of the footages and I have the pictures that I took to put in an album. But yeah, I just wanted to say um, I hope you guys liked the vlog. I didn't end it, so here's me ending it now. So I hope you guys liked the vlog and I'll see you guys in day two of Vlogmas. Peace!